Resident Evil 4 Remake has been out for a couple weeks now and I wanted to cover a video about the ending. Now we all are aware of the original Resident Evil 4 ending but in the Resident Evil 4 Remake we got a different one. Before I do continue on, I do want to let you guys know that there's going to be spoilers in this video and I would not like to ruin the experience for you. So if you guys haven't played the remake, I would highly advise you guys to finish it. Maybe come back to this video. It's your choice. I would really appreciate it. But other than that, guys, let's get right into this. My name is Uprising Hero and I would love for you guys to subscribe to the channel, like this video and put notifications on so you guys don't miss any brand new videos I got coming your way. Before I do get ahead of myself, I just really want to talk about some Resident Evil 5 for a minute. Now, if we were to get a remake, which I highly doubt will be in the next year or two, I think it's going to be a couple years away. Reason being said, I just think that Capcom is kind of burnt out on making all these remakes. I think they should really try and create something new with the Resident Evil franchise. Now, there's two things that I can think off the back of my mind with the route that Capcom is going to be taking with the franchise and I honestly want to share them. The first route I think that's most likely going to be happening is that Capcom is going to take time off from the remakes and really settle in on a new game, like a new installment, something fresh, something new and honestly I agree with this. Now obviously I want to see remakes happen more with the Resident Evil franchise. I think Resident Evil 5 is a splendid game for what it is. It's not perfect but it is one of my favorite Resident Evil games and I do want to see this remade. I do think Capcom can honestly pull it off especially what they did with Resident Evil 4 but this time around it has to be different. But Let's wait for now. Let's honestly give Capcom some room to breathe and create some new games with the Resident Evil name. Now, I am interested in seeing what Capcom is up to next. And quite honestly, I just am fascinated what they are going to do with the Resident Evil 5 remake when it comes around. Now, I think personally, the second route that Capcom could take with the Resident Evil universe is quite honestly just reboot the entire franchise and i mean we already have the remix that could be a fresh clean slate for the games right we have the original gamecube so i don't think capcom would honestly use the resources to make another remake of their beloved classic but i mean we could beg to differ but at the same time i think the gamecube remake is already good as it is from what i've seen we have resident evil 2 remake resident evil 3 remake resident evil 4 remake and if it comes around with that we get the fifth remake for resident evil 5 obviously it can still be the same narrative but just have things sprinkled in there in the story and change up a few things now let's talk about the ending of Resident Evil 4 and I'm talking about the remake. Now this time around it's different. Now everything goes according to plan. Ada takes the sample, Leon escapes with Ashley, but Ada has a change of heart and this is probably one of the best moments in Resident Evil 4 and her character has like a little change of heart too instead of going to and giving it to wesker she forces the pilot to take her somewhere else that somewhere we don't know and finally once we get the reveal of wesker's screen uh showing us all of his backgrounds and everything that he's looking at while talking to ada we get these images on the screen to his left and these images are of resident evil 5. now you guys are probably wondering what you're looking at now let's zoom in just a little bit now this is a cell excella gian i think that's how you say her name and the other photo is of a picture of like the garden in africa where i want to say chris and sheva find and that's i think in one of the tricell camps it's up in the air how capcom is gonna go forward with resin evil 5. they definitely did tease it at the end of four now it's just the waiting game we just see what they're gonna do maybe they're working on it now maybe they're not we'll get some leaks in the future i know we are going to there's no doubt in my mind that people are already probably 
pre-conceptualizing the game. I'm pretty sure the devs are probably working on the early stages of it. Capcom is huge. I'm sure they probably have a couple studios working on it or maybe one studio or whatever the case may be. But that's it, guys. Resident Evil 4 was hinted or I'm sorry, Resident Evil 5 was hinted at the end of Resident Evil 4. What do you guys think of it? Let me know in the comment section below. But other than that, guys, that's going to have to wrap up today's video. I hope you guys definitely did enjoy it. And other than that, guys, I hope you guys have a good day.